Electric vehicle owners will be able to travel the 400 plus mile drive between here and Las Vegas without running out of power in the near future. Amanda Ketchledge is live in Carson City where they announced the Nevada Electric Highway. Amanda, what does this mean for Nevada? Well, this means that Nevada is going to be once again a leader in energy, but officials also say that it's going to be providing security for those on the road. We'll have charging stations in some of those rural communities like Tonopah, like Indian Springs and Hawthorne. And, and so we, you know, we want to have the ability to encourage people to travel from Las Vegas to Reno. And now you'll be able to do, I mean, when they're built out, you'll be able to do that. Officials also hope to ease the worry of running out of gas with electric charging stations installed along US 95. So far, there are 150 in the state, and today they announced five more to come. One is already being installed in Beatty, Nevada, and officials say it will help promote tourism in these rural towns. And by electrifying the highway, officials also hope to reduce the state's dependence on petroleum. This Nevada electric highway, with the commitment of Governor Sandoval and NV Energy, will help us shift a portion of our transportation fuels that we consume in Nevada to Nevada's indigenous renewable energy resources. And if your business is interested in adding a charging station along US 95, you can find the application on our website at ktpn.com. And once again, these charging stations will actually be free for the five for the next five years. Covering the story, Amanda Ketchledge, Channel 2 News.